will be indifferent to the plight of sinners. Without this passion, we will be filled with needless shyness. So let's pray that we will not be held down by shyness or fear. I will not be giving false hope to sinners. When we begin to see the work of God and we see it as a pressure, then it's an obvious indication of lack of passion. Let's pray so that the very love of God, as we had it before, we fill our hearts. We want to pray that we have the same mind with the Lord Jesus Christ so that as he would say, I must work the work of him that sent me while it is day. The night comes in. God surely will help us. Let's thank God for hearing us. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, we thank you very much for the awakening you have granted unto us through the short exhortation we just had. Father, there is no argument. We are sorry we are, we have lost our passion, O oh Lord. Have mercy in Jesus' name. We pray that the, the passion will return unto us and that as the Lord Jesus Christ with all earnestness went everywhere preaching the word, teaching and healing, we will also take after his test with the same mind, full of passion, going everywhere. And particularly at this period of time, where we have so many converts to follow up with passion, we follow them up and ensure their discipleship. Not only that, O oh Lord, as the global Easter retreat is coming up, with passion by your grace, we will go out in praying, in preparing and publicizing it. Also, as another global crusade comes up, before the end of this month, with passion restored, we will publicize. We will pray. We will yield ourselves. And in every location, in every nation, many will be gathered together unto you. And they will be saved. And there will be many miracles by your grace. We know you have answered us. Thank you very much, our dear Father. In Jesus' name we pray.